the axis has got this dens like structure you see here. Here's a good, uh, so here's a generic cervical vertebrae. So here's how you can tell you've got a cervical vertebrae. Number one, you've got these transverse vertebrae. So transverse means on the side. Foramen means what again, guys? Pole, right? So pole, okay? And then you're gonna have a split or bifid spinous process. So it's gonna be split like this, okay? Here's how you can tell if you have a thoracic vertebrae. Okay, this is really, take the vertebrae and point it at you. Can you see the giraffe head? Thank you. See the giraffe? Okay. So if you see the giraffe head, that's a thoracic vertebrae. Okay. And then lumbar vertebrae is super easy. It's good for a very large body. Okay. So that's how you can tell the difference between a thoracic, lum, uh, lumbar, and cervical vertebrae. Um, for the fetal skull, the only thing I really want you to know is the fontanelle. So those are those soft spots we talked about, right? So baby's heads are fused, right? So you've got a, a coronal uh, fontanelle, you've got a, a anterolateral and posterolateral fontanelle, okay? So those are the soft spots. That's why you've got a newborn baby, right? Up to about a year and a half old, right? So you can't just leave the baby flat on the on its back, right? You gotta right? you gotta turn the baby like a rotisserie chicken, otherwise the baby will end up with a flat spot on its head. Right? Um, bones of the ear, okay? So there's the three bones: malleus, incus, and stapes, which means hammer and little pincer. Good way to remember, right? What's a big rubber hammer called? A mallet. Mallet, right? So malleus, incus, and stapes, hammer and bill and stirrup. So again, this is real to life size that you have. Um, that's pretty much it as far as that goes. Uh, so for the quiz on Tuesday, bones of the skull, the three vertebrae, the three uh, ossicles, and the hyoid bone. Any questions on any of that material? You said it was bones of the skull, three vertebrae, and what? Three, three vertebrae, the three ossicles. Oscles, O S S I C L E S. And the last one you said? Oh, uh, Hyo. Hyo? H Y O I D. So, like, you have to be able to point them out and the function. Correct. Yeah, so pretty much going forward, it's mostly going to be identifying the structure. So it's, what is this bone, or what's this process on bone, or what's this hole, or what's this thing, right? So it's going to be primarily identifying stuff by looking at it going forward. They said bone to the skull, three vertebrae, three ossicles. I am bone. Yes, sir. Any questions on any of this material? No? All right. Have a good evening, guys. Hopefully it's not raining out there.